Hi teachers. So today I wanted to show you a hack if you want to make extra problems from my digital companion lessons. Each lesson includes 10 problems and I've heard from some teachers wanting to know what options they have if they want to make more problems to practice the skill again with their students and um, just what they can do besides the 10 problems, especially if they want to do some reteaching. So today I'm going to show you a hack. Now this isn't a perfect solution, but it really can help you um, just create some more problems for your students. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this slide and let's say I want to make another problem where students will write this number in written form. So as you can see, this is all flattened. Okay, so this isn't editable. You can't go in and type this num um, edit this number and put a new number in. You can't change the problem. But this box here is editable. So what you would do is you would go over here and you would duplicate the slide. So this gives you another problem. Okay, and what you're going to do is you're going to insert table one by one and this is where you're going to type your new number okay and I want to make this font really big so I'm gonna to go to like size 36 and I'm gonna type 47 okay now I'm gonna center it and I'm gonna increase that size a little more so it looks the same as the others now all you need to do is go over here to fill and give this box a white fill. You can no longer see the problem and your students can come here and type. Okay, And then what you can do is you can even come up here and you can change maybe to number six. And for this you'll have to use my teal color and I will leave the hex codes for all the colors I use. I'll leave those in the, um, the description section of this video. You would just come in here, match the color, and, oops, that's the line. Colors over here, okay? And there you go. So you can use it and you would adjust the size to make that look better, but you can use this to create more assignments. It'll work for most of my lessons. Right here, you would just insert a new table right here and put a new number. There are a few lessons such as this one. I pulled this up just to show you this kind of lesson obviously wouldn't work because I included clip art. But for most of them that use digits, you definitely could do this. So I hope this can help you create extra problems for your students.